What's up guys? Today I would like to unbox a very cool device called the SMSL IDEA DAC. This is a super small uh, headphone amplifier and DAC and I'm really excited to get to show you this because I just got it from Masdrop. Let's open up the box and see what's inside. Uh, some manuals here not so important and look at these oh my god it's so small look at this look how tiny it is let's take it out and talk about it later also inside the box we have three cables um what we have here we have um usb uh usb-c to micro usb cable that's one thing very nice the second one is a uh, regular micro USB to USB cable and the third one is micro USB to micro USB very nice all right let's move on to the star of the show boom look at this how beautiful it is so small and size almost the size of a triple a battery I might have something here all right check it out almost the size of a triple a battery look at this look how small it is Wow okay so let's take a look around we have the micro USB uh, from the uh, one side and we have a 3.5 millimeter jack on the other side and on top of it we have volume up and down which is very important because it lets you control your music and audio from here and not from um, the uh, computer itself or your mobile device. Um, more detail and specs about this SML, SMSL IDEA DAC. Uh, it measures 2.25 inches long and uh, weighs only 9 grams. That's amazing. Uh, other than that, it has a Sabra ES9018Q2C uh, chipset inside. This is uh, you know, a mobile version of the Sabra high-end uh, DAC and you can find it in some of the top high quality um, uh, DAC boxes around the world very very good this is a beast guys this is I mean the top of the line I mean everything you can get in a small device and it's super super impressive if you're asking me a lot better than the Dragonfly Red, which a lot of people like. This one has DSD 512. 512 DSD with the same power. I mean, what else can you ask for? Anyway, I'm going to uh, test this thing out and connect it to my computer and to my mobile devices. And I'm going to get back to you with some more impressions. All right, so I'm back guys after testing out this tiny impressive little device and let me tell you something this thing is amazing uh, I've tested it with my laptop and some of my mobile devices the iPhone and the Huawei P10 which is an Android device and I, I'm, I'm really impressed the sound is clear a lot of details soundstage is amazingly huge and 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 sound you know coming out of this is uh, relatively neutral uh, if you like it and I'm using the Pinnacle P1 and the Sennheiser 6XX uh, so you can think about it and uh, if you have the same headphones I will let you know how it feels 
just to let you know if you want to get this for your computer you can just plug and play it will work but you can also uh, get the drivers from the company's website I will leave the links below so you can get them directly from the uh, from here from the video from the description anyway it works very well with the computer I had no issues whatsoever uh, when I connected this to the iPhone through the camera kit it worked well no issues at all but you have to know when I connected this one to a couple of Android devices I have I had a problem it started to have this strange uh, buzz noise and it was really really annoying but I'm glad I, I managed to uh, solve this problem and I will let you know how to do it uh, in this video all right at this point the SMSL ID DAC is connected to the Huawei P10 Android mobile device and it will create this uh, pesky buzz noise and to solve it out all you have to do is very simply you know scroll down okay scroll down you can see here you can see charging our device via USB click on it and it will show you that you see it is charging the device reverse charging this uh, thing creates the buzz noise all you have to do is switch to MIDI use device for MIDI input and that's it guys that's it it will launch the app and it will play your music without the noise you know it's that simple so I've seen a lot of people complaining about it this is a solution for you at this point I hope they're going to fix it with the next firmware as you can see here there's a little LED light and it indicates the frequency of your audio file so right now it plays uh, regular files so the LED light is in blue but if you're gonna play flag for example it will change to purple so you have an indicator here and it will change the color based on uh, the file that you're playing finally guys I know that a lot of you are asking about the Sennheiser 6xx and the 650 whether the SMSL idea can actually power this thing and push them to the limit well let me tell you from my experience it definitely is I did have to play a little bit with the equalizer but the SMSL uh, managed to play the music quite well and it sounds really good with the 6xx so to answer your question the answer is absolutely yes so highly recommended with the 6xx as well um, anyway I'm really pleased with this uh, DAC and headphone amp the SMSL idea I think it's a great bang for your buck and for under $70 I believe in on mass drop I paid like $65 for it and you can also find it on Amazon I'm gonna leave the links below so you can check them out definitely recommended SMSL ID DAC and headphone amp if you like this video please subscribe and leave the thumbs up until next time guys peace